My name is Dr. Anthony Sims. I am a dentist here in Columbia, Maryland. King Solomon said in Proverbs 4, Wisdom is the principal thing. Therefore, get wisdom. But with all thy getting, get understanding. We have knowledge of the anatomical structures of the dental system, but we do not fully understand its function. In my study of Ecclesiastes 12, God has helped me to understand the depth of how our systems are interconnected. Specifically speaking, we're talking about movement disorders, and within movement disorders, Tourette's syndrome. In the 1800s, Dr. Gilles de la Tourette wrote about patients who had involuntary tics and body movements. What you're about to witness are patients who we have treated who have been diagnosed with Tourette's syndrome, whose quality of life we have been able to increase. Lamar Hayward. Right? Hello. How are you doing? All right. Lamar has Tourette's syndrome. And you've had it since? Since I was fifth and sixth grade is what? Nine and ten. <coughs> okay. Um, tell us about the symptoms that you get. I get <coughs> I have motor tics, which caused me to blink my eyes, facial grimace, crack my jaw a little, open it up, close it. I mostly had the head jerks though, where I would jerk to my right side. I, oh, I also have vocal tics. I have vocal tics, you know, loud coughs. I don't, it's not because I have a cold that actually ticks. And that's pretty much it. I'll adjust, I'll, I'll adjust my clothes all the time. <laughs> it's just kind of happens. I don't know where. Okay. Um, tell us about uh, your eyes. The eyes. Oh, yeah, and... yeah. I have a, my right, I'm oh, sorry. My right eye is, uh, is lazy. It, if I look certain ways, it'll roll, it'll actually go and I seem like I feel cross-eyed and I can't really see. It started, it started really in grammar school, grade school. I would get <coughs> picked on, put out of class because teachers figured I was disrupting class or whatever. <coughs> uh, I was one of the best readers in my class and just to have a reason to get me out of school, they tried to say I had a reading problem, had a learning disability. This is before they really knew what Tourette's was, so once everybody found out what it was, you know, I basically was, I would basically go from doctor to neurologist to orthopedic, get put on different type of uh, muscle relaxers, different type of medications, Haldol, Tegretol, or at uh, over-the-counter drugs just to try to calm me down. How did you like those drugs? Uh, didn't like them at all <clears throat> because I'm a real upbeat type of person and I play sports. I, I always try to stay on the go, but with with the uh, <coughs> muscle relaxers, they if I wouldn't get a rash from them, I would always stay real tired, like mummified, just down and out. <clears throat> Even though my tics were kind of suppressed, I mean, my whole life was suppressed too because I wouldn't have the urge or to do anything. There you go. <clears throat> and as you can see,
be. I, even though, even though I'm not supposed to be, I'm actually trying to still suppress some of my ticks. But and you can see most of my ticks come from my shoulder to my head or my shoulder to my ear, and they they're the ones that that are actually causing me. See, as you can see, this is actually my strong side. I'm right-handed in like sports and. I do everything with my right hand. And as you can see, my hand never completely opens. <coughs> my hand never really completely opens because of some of the damage that I've already done from my tits. I, this is my actual, my left side. As you can see, it's more definition. And this is, this is how this one is supposed to look. My shoulder is See, it's, it's very, very loose. I mean, you're not supposed to be able to do that. You know, it's actually like it's dislocated. And that bone sits, the actual shoulder blade sits very high in my ball and socket. is just hanging. <laughs> and you were going to, they had scheduled you for how many treatments? Okay. The, 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 they scheduled schedule me for like four treatments the, in September alone. And this is with and, the Botox? <laughs> no, this is just one of them was an MRI. So just for me to get an MRI, you know, I, I can't sit in no tube and keep still. I had to either get anesthesia or what she said, she what my doctor over there said that she was going to do was have me take two tablets of Valium just to put me completely out, and then I would have someone bring me into the lab so I could get a uh, MRI. That's just a simple procedure for MRI. I've got I'm gaining a lot of weakness <coughs> from having my ticks come from my right side all the time. And where my shoulder, right here, my shoulder actually comes out of, it actually comes out of the pocket like right now. And there's a lot of weakness. And also, if, if you could get my hand, <coughs> when I hold both arms up, I, I can extend my left but my right won't extend at all, and if, if you can see that my thumb is just not moving at all. Uh, as you can see all the definition on my left side and my bicep, but when this arm goes down, you won't see it come back up. That's because of my nerve damage that I've already done from the ticks. I actually, I'd have to go ahead. his shoulders. Okay. okay. And he just now took his deep breath. What we find on all Tourette's patients is they take a new deep breath, like a rewind. 